So we can show that one table, aggregating that one. One table is first first thing is level of employment. Level of employment. Okay. Next thing is aggregating demand price. Demand price, okay, like lakhs of workers. Bracket lakhs of workers and here also crores of rupees in crores of rupees okay now it is start from 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 we are to taking the level of employment, some lakhs of workers. 10 lakhs, 12 lakhs, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So here to go this one, we can aggregate in demand of prices. When 10 lakhs, when level of 10 lakhs workers, the aggregating demand price is 600, we are considered. Okay, next level of 10 lakhs workers, the aggregating demand price in crores rupees 625 and here also consider 650 675 700 725 750 we are consider that one okay the schedule is the schedule to explain aggregating schedule of aggregate demand okay so what is that one what will happen in this we can draw the one diagram that one so your diagram Here, O X X, O Y X. We are consider that one. Okay, in O X X, in employment, O Y Y aggregating demand price. demand price okay this is a cow ox x o y x o x x o y x the cow we can like going to the this coin this is called ad this is called ad here this a what's a a so it is the aggregate demand price we can show that one so what is that one so here to go when you are appoint the level of employment 10 lakhs the aggregating demand price is 600 when you are increasing the level of 11 lakhs workers then what will happen in this aggregating demand price includes 625 so when you are taking level of 13 lakhs workers here what will happen in this the aggregating demand price in crores 675 will be increase when you consider level of 14 so what will happen here in this the 
700 crores will be increasing. When level of 15 lakhs, so what will happen? 725 crores, the demand aggregating price will be increasing. Then six, 16 lakhs, here 70, 750 aggregate income price will be increasing. So totally what I am saying is morally, if you are increasing level of employment, they automatically it is the demand, the aggregate income price will be increasing. So this one, when you are going to draw the diagram, if you are going to consider in OX axis we are considering employing employment and of OY we are going to consider that appropriate that aggregating the demand price. So the what will happen is the curve will be like a spend of the C and uh, goods and uh, services, the crown of the livelihood. Whatever it is, that is curve it going to the left to right. The curve it is the left to right slope. It is slope down one to left to right. This is the curve it is showing that it starts from to A to D. Okay. So effective of demand. What sir? Effective of demand. The aggregating thus aggregating supply. Aggregating demand versus aggregating supply. Any demand can't be called as a defective. I mean to say next topic is effective demand. Effective demand. So effective demand means what is the point of view where aggregating demand and uh, aggregating supply every level what's an every level that is simply we saying ad is equals to as aggregating demand is equal to aggregating supply they can't be level effective demand when the aggregating demand it is equal to aggregating supply that is called economy equilibrium okay now we are showing the one table schedule then after curve we can show it the table we got, we are going to consider that one same table we are going to consider like this table we are showing first is we are going to consider level of employment level of employment okay next is aggregating supply price aggregating demand price aggregate supply price supply price aggregate demand price okay it is a lakhs workers it is a crores in rupee lakhs of workers in crores of rupees in crores of rupees okay now we can show that one Now we are going to consider from 10 to 16 lakhs workers here 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, now demand. What will happen in this demand? Supply 500. 
फाइव फिफ्टी सिक्स हंड्रेड सिक्स हंड्रेड सिक्स फिफ्टी सेवन हंड्रेड सेवन फिफ्टी एट हंड्रेड वी आर टेकिंग दैट वन एग्रीगेट इन सप्लाई सो वाट विल हैपन इन दिस एग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड इन प्राइस वी आर गोइंग टू कंसिडर हियर सिक्स हंड्रेड नेक्स्ट इज सिक्स ट्वेंटी फाइव सिक्स फिफ्टी सिक्स फिफ्टी सिक्स सेवेंटी फाइव सेवन हंड्रेड सेवन ट्वेंटी फाइव सेवन फिफ्टी सेवन फिफ्टी सो हियर आई एम ऑलरेडी टोल दस वन द अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड मीन्स इफ द लेवल ऑफ अग्री अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड इज इक्वल्स टू द लेवल ऑफ अग्रीगेटिंग सप्लाई मीन्स इट इज एफेक्ट ऑन इज इक्वल्स टू ए डी इज ईक्वल्स टू ए एस मीन्स अग्रीगेटिंग इज अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड इज ईक्वल टू अग्रीगेटिंग सप्लाई सो इन दिस कैटगरी पर्टिकुलर स्टेज द अग्रीगेटिंग सप्लाई इज ईक्वल टू अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड वी कैन शो इट सो वाट इज द पर्टिकुलर स्टेज द पर्टिकुलर लेवल ऑफ वेन लेवल ऑफ वर्कर्स इन फोर्टीन लैक्स इन अग्रीगेटिंग सप्लाई इन क्रोर्स ऑफ सेवन हंड्रेड द अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड प्राइज इज इन क्रोर्स ऑफ सेवन हंड्रेड दिस इज द स्टेज शो दैट वन इन लेवल ऑफ फोर्टीन क्रोर्स वर्कर्स ऑफ दैट सेवन हंड्रेड अग्रीगेटिंग सप्लाई एंड सेवन हंड्रेड अग्रीगेटिंग डिमांड प्राइज ओके सेम थिंग्स वी आर शोइंग द वन डायग्राम टू वॉट इज द रिफ्लेक्टेड द डायग्राम वी कैन शो इट वन सेम थिंग वी आर गोइंग टू कंसिडर दैट वन ओके हियर टू एम्प्लॉयमेंट एंड नेक्स्ट इज द वी आर गोइंग टू कंसिडर समथिंग फर्स्ट इज वी कैन स्टार्ट द वन स्टेज दैट इज थिंग स्टेज वी आर गोइंग टू स्टेट दैट वन कार टू मेन्टेन दैट वन here to go their employment here cows we maintain that one that is the asp adp asp adp means aggregating supply price aggregating demand price certain stage i mean to say the stage is i can point out that one this is the stage i can find out i find out this is a stage this is a stage we can find out that one en2 what's that en2 so next is car started that one a car we going to like this scoos and the next is cows moving that from here to go cows then third car going to like this going to like this the shapes is there now this is the shape this is the shape it is a cut it the even we are going to that what sir e1 so moreover the curve going to reflected this one the stage is e2 stage is e2 curve we can show that one this is called ad1 which one ad1 and the next curve is it is show that one inflation of the group inflation of gap inflation of the gap we can show that one here we can write that one ad2 is equals to what sir 
82 is equals to C plus I plus G. C plus I plus G. Okay. Yes, next is AD1 is equals to. This is called AD1 is equals to C plus I. C plus I. We can show that one. And here to go. This is a N1. We can show that one. N1 we can show that one. So this is the stage now. What is the stage? The stage is there now. What is the stage? Here this go. This stage is from here to this stage is inflation stage.